Good morning, y'all. It's the day after Christmas, and of course, we are headed into work. Again, let me introduce myself as I always do. It is being Armanda Denise. Welcome to my channel. I hope you guys like all my content, all the things that I'm putting out. I hope that you're enjoying your holiday season. Like I said, it's the day after Christmas, and yes, I'm headed into work. As you guys know, if you're part of my channel, if you don't move your feet, you don't eat. That is my motto. And right now, this is where I'm at with how I make money. So, good morning. I hope you guys are having a wonderful holiday season, a great Tuesday morning. And I hope you got everything your heart desired, desires on Christmas Day. From me to you, to you to me, from mine to yours, from yours to mine, happy holidays. And um, I'm looking forward to the new year. I don't plan on going anywhere. I probably will be here for the new year. Um, me and my daughter is planning a manifestation party and things of that nature. So we're trying to put that together. But yeah, so um, of course, I'm always in my car heading somewhere. Y'all... I have a band, headband on my uh, sew-in. Um, I'm thinking about doing more wigs. I am because I don't like that my hair is out. And like I told you guys in a couple vlogs that um, I'm always bothering with my hair. But my leave out is mine and I don't like putting all that heat to it. So I think I'm going to try and um, just start wearing wigs and giving you guys more content with wigs and braids. Because... I'm a braid girl, so after I take this out, which will probably happen, I want to say it's going to happen um, before the new year. Um, sometime this week, I'm going to take it down and put some braids in my head, and I'm going to show you guys how I do that. Um, but nothing really high-key going this week. I hope you guys enjoyed my vlogs for what I did before Christmas. Um and, uh, yeah, I'm going to give you, I'm going to put out my Christmas Day vlog today. And this is just going to be a regular vlog that I'm doing. Uh, and I'm trying to put, push out three, maybe three videos a week, increments of 30 or less. Uh, I hope that ramps up my viewing on my page and things of that nature and give you guys great content. That's what I really want to do because I love doing this, even if I'm not getting paid for it. I, it's, it's just enjoyable to vlog your life, journal your life. This is like um, elect, um, a digital journal for me, and I love that. Um, so, yeah, again, this is being Armanda Denise. Um, if you like my content, please consider subscribing to my channel. Don't forget to hit like and share and the post notification down below so that you're reminded of every time I post a video. This is how we grow. This is how we become more out there in the world. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm headed to work, y'all. I really don't want to. I really don't want to go. But of course, I don't ever want to go because <laughs> work is not fun anymore how it used to be so I think I have to start looking at different avenues or something else more fun that I can do to make money because I feel like anything you're doing you're at your best when you love doing it so now with this job or this career the path that I've went down I no longer want to do it um, it's no longer fun for me. So I'm going to bring you guys along on this journey. I've been a child support representative. I've been a market marketing representative. I've been an accountant. I've been um, now a recruiter. Um, I still like the recruiter avenue. It gives you a lot of freedom, honestly. But how things are set up at my work. It's just not fun for me anymore. So like I said, when things get aren't fun anymore, you tend to it tends to feel like a job and it's it's not something I like. I don't like for my work to feel like work. I like for my work to feel like it's fun and I'm going into a new thing today and trying to figure out so many things. So that's where I'm at now. So I'm going to start venturing out and looking at other things because 
again i need for my work to feel like fun and not work so that's when i'm at my best i am a gemini to my heart and don't go in on me because most people go in on gemini's with the um two people type thing but i am a gemini at heart and honestly i like change i don't like the same flow of ebb and flow of things and that's how i ended up on youtube just starting because I can give y'all a taste of everything. I could do food, I could do clothes, I could do travel, I could do day in the life. It's so many avenues here and it's so much fun. And I'm trying to be my authentic self always on this camera, always on this camera. I'm trying to be my authentic self and I hope that resonates with my community, with those who watch me. And I hope, you know, one day, it becomes something if not i'm still gonna do it it's still gonna be a thing for me and um yeah we're gonna vibe out so this morning i'm here with the word um of encouragement because i felt like i needed it too um again like i said uh find something you love doing and you'll never work a day in your life i don't know who said it but i know it's a solid quote that's out there and it's real I have not ever worked really a day in my life because everything I've done, I've loved. However, when I love it no more, I shift, I transition and transition is good. So I'm thinking about a transitional plane for myself because it, it, it probably is time. Like I said, I am not as happy or it's not as fun as it used to be. So yeah. It's not as fun as it used to be. I don't want to technically do it anymore. So we're just going to move forward in positivity and light and manifest the things that we want to come true in actuality for our life for 2024 and beyond. Um, I also want to say to those who watch me, please, I, I want to do in my manifestation post for 2024 going into the new year, I want to do um, Q&A. Uh, if you have any questions, whether it be for me or anything you've seen in my vlogs or my personal life and you want to know, I'm asking that you please ask me those questions on Instagram. I'll be happy to answer any questions. I am an open book. I am not shy at all. I'm going to put the same post on my IG for my IG followers to ask me questions as well and then we're gonna get a little q a sesh going while um i'm doing that manifestation party so that i can put it out new year's eve going into the new year i feel like that'll be a nice little vibe for y'all so yeah but we're headed in i'll probably pick you guys up when i'm doing something much more fun but for now we are just headed into work the day after christmas so um yeah yeah that's it i hope you guys have a wonderful day and i'll see you soon good morning it's your girl armanda denise welcome to being armanda denise it is a lovely thursday morning the weekend before the new year i just wanted to pop on here and let you guys know of course i am working as always if we don't move our feet we don't eat if you are new to my channel i hope you consider subscribing um over here we lit it's a whole vibe when i am not just looking regular degula but even when i'm looking regular degula we're still vibing out however um if you're interested in um if you're viewing my channel right now and you find me interesting please consider subscribing to my channel please hit that post notification below so that you're reminded of every time i post a video also like comment and share i sometimes reply when i have the time i would love to interact with you guys that is how we grow as a community that's how we move forward so y'all i'm headed into work i feel like all i do is work i feel like that's all i got going on after before christmas after christmas that's just it that's all i got going on i haven't had time to plan my beginning of the year trip any of it because i just don't have time 
So I'm not sure. I know um, I'm taking my daughter back to Louisiana for school, of course. So I'm definitely going to vlog that. Um, I'm not going to leave y'all in the dark there. Uh, however, um, I don't know why this thing shake. It's on the tripod and the tripod is supposed to be all together but it's it's not it's shaky now so maybe I gotta tighten something and I'm just missing what that is I have to tighten up so we'll see but yeah so I'm going to take my daughter back to Louisiana so I'm gonna vlog that we'll probably do something in New Orleans for sure that's fun before I head back up here to Atlanta Georgia um I'm trying to think of what else I'm trying to think of what else. Um, I want to plan a trip to Denver or, um, well, not Denver, because Denver is not first on my list. Y'all see that? It's so ugly on my finger. I burned my hand on the stove like weeks ago, and it's just now getting itself together. So please don't be distracted by the little scar on my finger. And if y'all wondering what I'm putting on my lips, because I love this stuff. I really, really do love it. It is Butter Gloss by NYX. Butter Gloss by NYX. Um, this one is Sugar Glass. So it's clear. It's that same brown one. That same brand that I use for my brown lip, lip, lip gloss. So it's Butter Gloss. By Nick, y'all, it is 8 22 and I'm supposed to be working at 8 30. I live across town, I don't live by my job, it's a whole thing, but again, I don't really care because what can I do? Like, and let me tell you how, let me tell you how this go. My boss, of course, because you, you're in a financial state that you can, but lives three minutes from the job. Everybody else lives hours. Well, not hours. I'm exaggerating. Maybe an hour or 30 minutes or more. Between an hour and 30 minutes or more. So, girl, give us grace. Anyway, she's off today. So, I'm in the office with another coworker. It's just me and her. And it should be fun. Um, it's been quiet, low-key, and all the things. So, y'all have a bump coming in right there. My um, PCOS is about to flare up. And usually when I get them down here, I can, I know when it's about to flare. Anyways, how are you guys doing? What are your plans for New Year's Eve? Um, what are your plans? I always say I don't have any plans, and then somebody will end up inviting me somewhere. I really don't have any plans to do anything for New Year's Eve. Um, really 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 don't but i'm gonna try and make some shake if i want to get out because right now i don't want to get out i kind of want to chill around the house and be with my daughter because we're supposed to do our um manifestation stuff so i'm probably gonna record for that i'm probably gonna give you guys a story time in my cozy little house once i get everything all organized and put away because i'm gonna take down my christmas tree asap um i'm usually a person who lets my christmas tree stay up for until the new year maybe a month after but i feel like something in my spirit is telling me to get my house organized get myself in order because the new year is about to be a glow up it's about to be success it's screaming money spiritual development financial development physical development so i'm looking forward to all of those things so i got to get on my ish so that I'm ready to receive my gifts in 2024. Anybody else receive it? Receive it. That's a message for y'all. So get your house in order so that you're prepared for the things that's coming your way. And so that's my goal. That's what I'm doing. And that's what I plan on doing uh, right before the new year. So yeah, I probably won't be hanging out as much. Um, but if I do, you know, I'm going to pick up the, I'm going to pick up this camera and start vlogging the things that I'm doing. And somebody, I, my thing is, I'm living in my just do it era. Like, it's shaking. I don't know why. So, y'all might have to figure that out because it's not supposed to be shaking at all. So, I'm in my just do it era, as I was saying. 
and it means just hop into the things you want to do and do them whether they make you feel comfortable uncomfortable they say you need a little uncomfort they say you need a little uncomfortableness to be pushed to be successful in any way so i do feel uncomfortable vlogging out with the camera or like driving in a car and people see me talking to the camera but don't see nobody so i kind of feel kind of uncomfortable but i also love it so it's making me more comfortable with doing this talking to you guys looking directly into the camera walking around with it out in public so i'm gonna say if you want to do this, just do it. I only have, I mean, and I'm not going to say only because I appreciate my 27 subscribers. On the weights, on the road to 1K, on the road to 1K is where I'm moving. However, in the midst of building that subscribe subscription of people, be humble and thankful where you are too and just start. It doesn't matter. Like, I had no plan. I don't have my things all planned out. I wish I did. I'm learning and I'm going to do more that causes uh, that to happen. However, for right now, I am just basking in the glory of learning and doing it and putting out the content because it makes me happy. So, yeah, I'm going to say just do it. You'll figure out the steps along the way. Y'all got this headband on. Oh, I'm going to be braiding my hair too. So I may do a tutorial on that if you guys want it. I'm still going to do it. If you have any questions after looking at my tutorial, please let me know. I'll be happy to share my my um, knowledge with you. I don't gatekeep over here at all. So yeah. Um, and uh, outfit for today. Nothing fancy. I'm mis mix matched all the way. I have on my Nike jumper long sleeve shirt um a pair of denim blue jeans that i got from fashion nova and my ugg boots yeah and a band for this head but y'all i am all over the place so yeah but in the interim of that uh we are working today it's it's a light day like i'm not really gonna be doing a lot I maybe have a couple things i have to do but after that it's a wrap and look it don't swell up my jaw y'all Maybe my period's gonna come on. I think so. Because it don't swallow my jaw a little bit. So, anyways. I'm rambling. And I, I don't know. I like rambling. Oh, what I was about to say is I look at other content creators and things like that. And one of them said it's harder to start a vlogging channel from scratch. If you have a niche, then you should do that niche. And then, you know, transition from there. I have many niches. However... I'm not focused on one, so I'm starting the vlogging. I'm not going to take the advice of that. That's what I say. I persevered through it all. I, I like looking at this person's channel. I don't necessarily know if I liked what she said, but she has more um, experience in the whole motion of doing this. So I take heed to it, but I'm still going to move forward with what I'm doing because this is what I love doing. Like I said, it's like a personal journal for me, and it gives y'all an insight into what I got going on. And when I say the sun is sunning, did y'all see it hit my face like it did? I love it, vitamin D. Come on. But anyways, I'll pick you guys back up when I'm doing something fun. Later, babes. Okay, y'all. I am off from work. I'm headed home. Traffic has been pretty nice since it's the holiday season. And of course, okay, son. Come through for your girl. Anywho, traffic has been really nice um since you know it's the holiday season and it's new year's new year's eve week so it's been pretty light nothing to report there however i am going to do a cooking video for you today i am doing fried shrimp and white rice with a honey hot sauce and me and my daughter are gonna sit down and kiki and eat our food. Um, so I'm gonna bring you guys, I'm gonna do that as a recording today. Like I said, I'm back to regular scheduled programming. Since Vlogmas is over, I am gonna try my best to get y'all at least three videos a week. Just because my goal is to gain more subscribers, more subbies, more people who will enjoy my content. Um, I'm hoping, fingers crossed. Um, I know it's hard to break into the YouTube industry without knowing anybody, but staying diligent and focused and posting and things like that should help me. So consistency is key and that's what I wanna continue to maintain and stay a part of, being consistent. So yeah we're gonna be consistent we're gonna do our thing we're gonna we're gonna pull this right on off so yeah y'all 
Um, but yeah, traffic hasn't been bad. It's actually been pretty decent. Work wasn't bad, y'all. I know I look a hot mess on Beyonce internet, but y'all bear with me because yes, I walked out my door and went to work looking like this this morning because what else I'm supposed to do? So I'm out here on Beyonce internet looking like somebody homeless friend that is me the homeless kiki however when i put that shit on i put it on so no problem this is just a bummy girl day like i said my job isn't one of those jobs where i'm have to be in front where i have to be in front of people every single day i can wake up roll over turn my computer on and tit 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 or i can go in throw some jeans on a little shirt a jacket a band over my hair and I'm out the door, no makeup, no nothing. And I'm sitting at my desk. Y'all seen it in another video doing what I do. So, yeah, when I get home, I'm going to... I want to do a clean with me video, but right now, I think I need to focus on just getting everything out of the house. Um, my thing is, like I said, I normally keep my Christmas tree up until the new year. <laughs> Honestly. Honestly, all of January, if I'm being honest. But this year, I want to do a different thing. I want to do a new process and actually have my house clean with the Christmas tree down and all the things uh, before New Year's Day. So, with that being said, we're going to clean some stuff up. We're going to get our things organized. And I'll just show you guys uh, the apartment when I um what's the name and again like I told y'all my PCOS is acting up so y'all see that bump right there it's bumping it's bumping I'm thinking maybe my period about to come on too so I don't know but anyways um yeah so I figure like new new findings new beginnings new things will flow in if I declutter now and not try to wait until the new year bringing those things into the new year because 2024 is our year right yes yes we are doing all things successful, spiritual, mental, physical. We get it all together in 2024. So that is the beginning of our success and beyond. So I feel like if we want all these organized things and all of this stuff to be right within, we have to first organize our life. So that's where I'm going to start. So, but for today, you're going to get the cooking video. We're doing fried shrimp and a uh, white rice with a honey hot sauce. So I'm excited about it. I'll be back when I get to the house. Okay, y'all. So I'm home. I just went to my mailbox to get some stuff. And my package came from Lorigo. Y'all, when I said I've been waiting on this thing for years, and I'm just excited because, I mean, even though it might be cheap, it's a cute little kiki. And these are, oh, this is the one. So I got a little cute denim boot. I'm so excited to wear. I did like like the ones with the clouds on them. But I'm going to try these. I'm going to try this on for y'all. These are so freaking cute. Oh my God. I'm obsessed with this denim boot. So yeah, we're going to go out in this. And it, it comes with a coat. Or, or, you know, I bought the coat as a thing. And if you guys have seen Laura Gale, so I'll give y'all my real review on this when I try it on at the house. But I'm so excited. It came in a little raunchy packaging. But again, ordering for China. I didn't even know L'Oreal was, was a China comp China Chinese company. So I have my package. I'm excited. I've been waiting since October for this to get sent to me. So I will be trying this on for you guys. Probably not tonight. I'm gonna do a little haul where I'm actually wearing the clothes that I bought. Um a few of the pieces so y'all can see if y'all like it for yourselves or not. But yeah, so I'm excited. Good morning. What's up, guys? It's your girl, Armanda Denise, and this is my channel, Being Armanda Denise. Welcome, 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 welcome. If you like the content that I'm giving and you like what I got going on, please consider subscribing to my channel. For those of you who like all my content, please like, comment, and share. And don't forget to hit that post notification so that you're reminded of every time I post a video. Okay, now that out the way, y'all, I am organizing hmm? my stuff for the new year trying to get my room in order trying to throw some things away i don't need and i came across this fenty beauty lip gloss or lipstick and it's red what we think i don't hate it 
I'm just not sure when I will wear it. So I put it on just to see how I look in it. And y'all, don't worry about this. My PCOS is now flaring up. So that's what I got going on now for right before the new year. However, I'm going to put it together because I'm going out for the for New Year's Eve. Anyways, I was coming on here to ask about my Fenty Beauty lip gloss. And I'm going into the bathroom. Like I said, forgive the room because everything is all over the place. I'm sorting things out. But yeah, I don't know what I do. I found this. I actually like how it looks on me. No, no shade, no tea. It's real cute. And I got on my... Um, my granny nightgown, my relaxed night gown. Y'all know when y'all ain't trying to do too much, but doing a lot. Um, this is my relaxed gown. Okay, and uh, it's this Fenty Beauty lip gloss that I found. I found a ton of makeup that I need to put in rotation. Uh, so I think I am. But the color is Strawberry Sangria. And it's real red and real pretty. I think it actually is really, really cute on me. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. Yay or nay if we like it. It's a poll. I have 27 people who watch me. So if y'all get to this part, y'all please let me know if y'all like it or not. Also, on the road to 1K, because I'm still mo motivated and moving forward. My hair look stupid mess. Y'all, I want to take it down to do braids, but I'm trying to see if I'm just going to revive it and keep it going until the new year and then do my braids in the beginning of the year. I think that's what I'm going to do since I'm going to Louisiana this coming weekend. So, yeah, but it's strawberry sangria. Oh, three. Um, it's Fenty and it's real cute. I really do like it. I don't hate it. It's giving. It's giving what I need to give. And I, mm, it's giving to me. So, poll on this. You like it, you don't like it. You think I need to throw it in the trash because it's not for your girl skin tone and complexion. Let me know. Let me know. But I think it is. I actually pretty much like it. So, y'all let me know. Let me know, because I don't hate it at all. I think it's pretty cute. So, I look forward to your in your input on my question, your decision on this strawberry sangria, what we doing with it. And, yeah. So, yeah. I'll be back. Okay, y'all, about to have this stuck. About to have this letter be get, um, can't talk right now. Yes, I'm still cleaning up. Don't worry about that. That ain't none of y'all business. But I am putting it on this camera, so maybe it is y'all business. Anywho, about to hit this lady vegan because I am starving and I'm supposed to start my vegan journey tomorrow. Be with me because I don't know how long I'm going to be able to do this. But I'm going to try. I'm going to try every fat, everything. I'm going to get more into exercise and taking my vitamins and all the things. Whew, that was a lot at one time. But I'm about to get in the shower, about to get myself together. And this mom just so ugly, y'all. But. Yeah, so we're about to head to Slutty Vegan, get us something to eat, and start this journey tomorrow. Hold tight. Okay, y'all. So, this is about to be the fit to run out and get, um, what's the name? We doing New Year's cleaning, so I'm still busted. And I'm about to show y'all um, my room. My room is a disaster. Don't judge me. Judge about hitting mammy, okay? Because coming for me will not be good for you. Um, but let me turn it around. So this is the fit. Um, I have on my Flintstone, not Flintstones. Oh my God. I have on my um, Simpsons Duff, Duff beer uh, um, sweater that I got from, um, I think an amusement park at one point in time. I got on my little um, leggings, of course, with my Balenciagas because it's just a run out fit to get the food and try it for y'all. Yes, my room is looking like this because I am trying to sort out things for the new year. So again, don't judge me. Judge your mom. So yeah, this the fit. I'm looking chunkier than a mug. But yeah. 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 So we heading out now. And I'll tell y'all, well, I might do a taste test on the thing, but y'all, this bump getting bigger and bigger as the day's getting later and later. Um, I don't know what I'm going to do for the new year. So anyways, I'm still going out, but I don't know. So let me find my purse and we about to jet it. Sexy, you be all I 
completely vegan and I'm, of course I'm in the room because because I'm still cleaning up so y'all just bear with me but I'm gonna try this on camera with y'all and let y'all know what I think of this whole thing so I'm gonna open it it smells real good y'all so let me at let me at oh it's messy I love a good messy burger y'all so it's real sloppy so we gonna keep it on the paper. We gonna see if we can sit this down and sit our fries on top of the paper. Good. <clears throat> this good old vegan burger. I'm probably even gonna fry up under there, but this is what we got, y'all. It smells so good. I'm gonna get me some ketchup for my fries. Of course, we have to do ketchup for fries. The sauce tastes really good. I just taste it on my hand, y'all. <sighs> okay. Put a little ketchup on my thighs. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I probably got the camera too far back, but bon appetit. I'm about to tell y'all my first. That's really good. That's real good. This is really good. Whatever the sauces they got, like a barbecue sauce. Sweet, spicy, and tangy. Real good. I just let it be in 10 out of 10. This is good. This is good. I didn't get me know that because as usual. I ain't gonna act like the dog bake. I mean, this bacon don't look like dog food, but it tastes good. Mm. Mm-hmm. It tastes like Okay, slutty. I'll see y'all. Mm-hmm. Mm And I got me a agave vanilla cream soda. So good. I'm going to tell y'all to run to Slutty Vegan. If this vegan, I can eat it every day. So it's real good. Mm hmm Well, I want to finish my meal. I'm going to wish you guys a happy... Happy, 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 happy New Year. I hope you got everything your heart desired for Christmas and throughout the year. Um, I hope you much health, wealth, much health, wealth, success, and happiness. Happy 2024. This is going to be our year. We get into it. We get into the bag. And we probably going to be on some PJs. We about to say. But I just want to say thank you so much for coming along with me on my journey. Again, if you like my content, please consider subscribing to my channel. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and hit that post notification so that you're reminded of every time I post a video. Again, Happy New Year. Looking forward to wonderful things coming. And I wish you guys the best of life. Bye.